Hello everyone, welcome to another upload. Hope you're all doing great. Now the LA Grand Prix is underway, started yesterday. And I know the 100 meter is of interest to many of my Jamaican viewers as we had Alana Reed going up against the like of Tia Clayton, Natasha Morrison and Lani Tave Thomas. The race has been run and I must say the times are very, very slow. We are now in the month of May. I'd love to see some improvements from these athletes, especially like a Natasha Morrison who qualified last year. Uh, Tia Clayton, Alana Reed, who we're anticipating are going to be our next generation of sprinters. Now, here's the result. Here are the results. In first place, we have Melissa Jefferson of the USA, who finished in a time of 11.27 seconds. Also from the USA, Akino Son, who came second in a time of 11.28 seconds. Lanita V. Thomas of Jamaica, she picked up third place in a time of 11.35 seconds. We have Alana Reed coming in fourth at a time of 11.36 seconds. In fifth place, Twanisha Terry at a time of 11.37 seconds. Tia Clayton came in sixth in a time of 11.47 seconds. Seventh place went to Natasha Morrison at a time of 11.5 one seconds. And Javian Oliver of the USA came in eight at a time of 11.53 seconds. No, I mentioned at the start of the video to say that these times are very very slow and i say this based on the fact that the qualifying time for women's for the women's 100 meters so if you want to stand any chance of getting a position at the olympics you have to be running at least 11.07 seconds and you can take into consideration that the big guns are going to be running possibly 10 8 sub 10 8 so as a female no me you want to be improving on your times and therefore this is the reason why i said that these times are very very slow because even the person who came first that time falls outside of the qualifying time for the women's 100 meter at the olympics which i say is 11.07 seconds now natasha morrison had a very very good season last year she actually pb she picked up an individual spot for the world championships and i would definitely i would definitely love to see your times improvement uh improving as the national trials is probably a month away so for her to repeat picking up an individual spot this 11.51 seconds is definitely not going to cut it we know alan and tia they're very young they have recently gone pro and they are the next generation of sprinters but i do know that they will be going to the national trials as well hoping that they can make the olympic team so there is definitely room a whole heap of room for improvements for our jamaican athletes who participated today are you in agreement with me or is foolish bnj tv chatting drop a comment remember to like the video subscribe to the channel if you have not already done so and until my next upload take care